A fireball was seen hovering above Ararat on Saturday evening as firefighters from neighbouring towns were called to the burning factory. After a short time they uh, felt that it was uh, too aggressive and decided to get out of the building. We pulled all the crews out of the building and made an external attack. Director of Support Services at the East Grampians Health Service, Stuart Kerr, says the fire was terrifying. It was a very intense fire. Went into a low street, our aged care facility, and the staff in there had already activated the emergency procedures and they were told to uh, evacuate wing two. All the windows were closed and towers were placed underneath the doors in case the fumes contained asbestos. A group of kids started the blaze on Saturday afternoon, but thought it had been extinguished. Instead, it lay smouldering until erupting at 7.30pm. Police conduct an investigation in relation to the matter and uh, it resulted in some, uh, some news being spoken to on Sunday about the incident and um, it appears that, uh, that they have been involved. What started as a small fire quickly became too aggressive for the 80 firefighters on the scene and by around 8pm the factory had collapsed. Vacant for two decades, the old textile factory was once a source of income for hundreds of locals. A bit of a disappointment, but uh, yeah, sad, very sad. Recently, the abandoned site has been a hot spot for mini fires, while property developers struggle to get building permits from the local council. Yolanda Redrup, Win News.